Hello there my lovelies, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a brow tutorial for all of you. You can see that in the title of course. Anyway, if you want to know how I got these brows then keep watching and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up for more. I'm starting off by taking the spoolie side of the NYX brow pencil and just combing my brow hair in the direction of their growth or basically the direction that I want them to be which is exactly in the direction of my brow hair growth. Now I'm taking the Anastasia dip brow pomade or pomade whatever you call it in the shape Eb in the shade ebony and I'm just creating a line at the bottom of my brow. I'm not uh, actually starting from the beginning. I'm starting a few centimeters away from the beginning of the brow. That is because I want my brows to look natural. Now I'm taking the same product and again creating a line on top of my brow. So after creating a line at the bottom, I'm now creating a line on the top of my brow and bringing those two lines together at the end of my brow as you can see here. This basically gives your brow definition. The reason we do this is because we want well-defined, natural-looking brows. <laughs> now I'm taking the NYX brow pencil which is in the shape black and I'm just filling my brows in. This step is done to give your brows volume to make your brows look thicker but again they look thick and look naturally thick and do not look artificial or made up now I'm taking this gimme brow by benefit and just setting all the products in place as you can see here I'm taking the spoolie again and just combing my brows again and this is to blend all the products and make your brows look natural like I've already said a hundred times <laughs> now I'm taking the <laughs> Revlon Color Stay Concealer and just sculpting my brows. I'm repeating the exact same thing on the other side where I'm using the pomade now and just defining my brows as I told you. And again, I believe that my brows are sisters and not twins. So I go with the shape of my brows. I do not try to um like modify the shape of my brows i go with their natural shape and that's the reason i do not really mind if my brows do not look identical because hey i completely believe in the statement that my brows are sisters and not twins so i have no issue in them looking a little different because i believe in them looking natural this is a really quick and easy method as I just follow the shape of my brows and do not have to do much but just fill them in and make them look a little thicker. I use the combination of black and brown shade so that my eyebrow doesn't look crazy and look um, normal and natural. So uh, that is basically how I do my brows and I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. See you in my next video. Bye.